What do you call a crazy chicken? A cuckoo clock. Well, I'm trying my chicken jokes on everybody. Anyway, we're going to see what two-dimensional figures can be formed by slicing a rectangular prism. Now, a rectangular prism has three dimensions, length, width, and height. And in this particular one, the length and the width are the same. They're two meters, and the height is five meters. If we sliced off the bottom face, we would get a square that was two by two meters. We would actually, and if we sliced off the top, we would have another one. If we slice the front off, we get a two by five rectangle. Two by five meters. Now the use of this is that you could find the surface area because a rectangular prism is composed of six faces. The top and the bottom, since they're the same, two times two is four, so that's four square meters. There's two of them, so that would be eight square meters. And five times two is ten, and there's four identical faces on this particular rectangular prism. The front and the back are identical. The side is also 2 by 5. So there's 4 of them. 5 times 2 is 10, times 4 is 40. So if you add them together, you get 48 square meters. 